Xavier Suofilo, about four weeks in now to spring ball, only two practices left. Uh, there's good and bad about that. You know, I know you guys want to keep going, but yeah. your body's at this point. How are you feeling personally? Well, um, actually, I'm feeling better this week than I had. This week and last week, I felt better than I have for the all yeah. in between weeks. Um, I'm still a little sore, I guess, obviously banged up, but physically, yeah, I feel fine. You know, when you think about where you were on April 3rd and where you are now, how far of a difference is that for you? Oh, it's a huge difference. I still have a little, uh, little annoying things that I'm working on as far yeah. as, you know, technique goes, but I feel a lot more, you know, in a football mood, I feel in, in like, just like a football player again. Yeah. And uh, I think that I feel more comfortable just playing again. We talked about that even before the season, we, or, you know, before spring ball, we talked about it after day one, mm -hmm. just getting that first hit out of the way and all that kind of yeah. stuff. The process of, of kind of training your mind to be a football player again, how, how, how important is that for you? To Like you're kind of saying right now, to just not feel like you're out on the field for two hours a day, but that you are back in the football program. Well, I think because mentally and physically you have to be all in. And you have to be aware as offensive tackle, especially Absolutely. with the kind of fronts that our defense runs. <laughs> if your head's not up and you're not communicating yeah. and you're not mentally in the play, then you're out of the play, even if you know your assignment. Yeah. And so I think that, you know, knowing how defenses adapt, knowing our jobs, knowing how our calls change, and being completely focused on our jobs and aware of what, what's going on with football yeah. is all part of that mentality that helps you be more physical and not be so hesitant to come off the ball yeah, or sure. to punch or to, to kick out for a pass set. Yeah, that's a, it's a great point because everyone talks about your conditioning and, and, oh, it's so hard coming back from two years off just for your body, but your attitude and your mind is, is a whole other battle. Yeah, I mean, know? your body is going to get tired, there's no doubt, um, through, you know, first quarter, second quarter, your body's going to get tired, but mentally you have to have that toughness and that awareness when you can keep it 100% and stay sharp, yeah. even when you're tired, is, is I get a good indication of... You know, to me, yeah. that I'm, I'm getting somewhere and I'm learning and it's coming back again. Yeah. Uh, just last couple things for you. Uh, just sort of the leadership angle and, mm -hmm. and, and you kind of instantly gelling back into that offensive line. How, how has that gone? And, and especially with some of the younger offensive linemen who you never met. Mm -hmm. Well, I think that, you know, I am an older guy considered, I mean, in school I'm considered a freshman, yeah. but I'm an older guy that's considered you need to have experience of play. And so it's very important, especially being, you know, a starter right now, to be a leader and to do things right when coach asked me to to be sharp to be front first in line to jog and to hustle and and i think that even if i don't know the a lot of the younger linemen um it's my job to be an example to lead by example and um to show them you know how i guess how we work together as a unit and how we all need to be on the same page because there can't be one left behind yeah. as an offensive lineman we're all strong so um, to be together and i think it's important that me, Jeff, Baca, um, Greg Capella, a lot yeah. of the older guys, I consider with them because I played with them, that we step up and do be leaders and, and kind of um, take the offensive line where it needs to be. Yeah, I got you. Uh -huh. Good stuff, man. Xavier Suofilo off to tutoring, huh? Yeah. Now the fun part. Yeah, I got a review for me too. Okay, so. well, have fun with that. No, I will. Thanks, bud. Thanks a lot.